In September 2012, 15 Taliban insurgents took British and American troops by surprise when they infiltrated NATO's main military camp in Helmand province, where tens of thousands of troops were based. They attacked the airfield at Camp Bastion, and the ensuing gun battle lasted into the next day. It resulted in the deaths of two U.S. Marines and injured eight British personnel, as well as destroying six U.S. Harrier jets, the single most expensive blow struck by insurgents in this long campaign. The Defence Committee says that arrangements for manning the guard towers around Camp Bastion were inadequate and that insufficient attention was given to the fundamental need to defend the camp from external assault. It's absolutely essential that the Ministry of Defence learns proper lessons from the uh, events that happened here and doesn't display the complacency that we say did get displayed here. Um, you must protect your home base, you must not underestimate the enemy and you must put in place a proper system of command. None of those things happened here. The MPs conclude that British commanders must bear a degree of responsibility for what they term systemic failures. The Defence Secretary, Philip Hammond, says the MOD wasn't complacent and always sought to learn lessons from current operations. Caroline Wyatt, BBC News.